This wiki is looking to be a little tricky to get a handle on, so I'm going to be employing a little known trick. Thinking. Some may call it theory crafting, but whatever your flavor, our goal is to identify power spikes, power dips, effective combos, and ultimately, how to time our power curve to best fit the pets available. It's actually a lot of fun, and I think it's the best way to improve not only this weekly, but in the game as a whole. It's a slightly different style, so let me know if you like this analytic approach, or if you just prefer the typical bumbling around into occasional wins. It's going to be a lot of fun, so let's jump right in. And then the, the chipmunk here. Big. Big dub. Oh yeah. Alright. Level me. Are we hoopo birding it? <laughs> See, we have a bunch of support units. Alright, we'll hoopo bird just because we have the opossum here. And then let's... I don't want to sell these guys quite yet. We don't have anything to go into. So let's just get a couple African penguins out here. Peacock is good. Peacock lemur action. I actually don't think we need lemur. I think lemur is good when you don't have garlic. But we'll just wait for tier 3 and then we'll get garlic. Big snipes by the Hoopo bird. Fantastic work, my good friend. Okay, so we're gonna do this. I'm gonna buy sell the mouse. Give the you an apple. Um we want a swan. Now would be the time. I think we can. We've got room for it. And then we'll just roll a little bit, see what we can find. Not a whole lot. Maybe go spider, TBD. Oh, so close. Dude, we keep losing by one health, I swear. <laughs> um, okay. So right now we only have the one tier three. I think we can get rid of the beaver. I'm gonna keep the African penguin. It's better than the beaver. Big. Uh, I think garlic is more important, but definitely still important here. Huge. Um. Yeah, okay. Better fish, we have pills. Is a four cost or two good? Probably. I mean, if you're paying three for a pair, Blaking, I mean, you'd have to imagine it's worth it, right? Huge. Enormous. Alright, it would appear as though the African penguin has let us down yet again. Mm-mm, okay. Maybe we save the betta fish here. Oh, well, there's the African penguin. <laughs> okay. Hi, Key. Grab a baboon. Hey, if y'all want to buff each other, go right ahead. I don't care. <laughs> Not like the hoopa birds that that important of a buff. Ooh, deals an extra one damage through the melon. Only a peacock. Could do that. Okay, level me. Okay. Uh, I would love to go zebra, but I don't know what toys these are. Oh, dude. Oh, it's flashlight all day, brother. Alright. Yeah, now we're talking. We do need a tier 4. Um, don't think I forgot. Uh, what tier? Waffle? Okay, so it's probably good to keep the Stingray around. Go here. Um, these guys are doing nothing. I have now realized. <laughs> okay. 
Problem identified. Working on a solution. We'll grab a stoat. That might be our solution. This is not good, by the way. <laughs> Losing out on 3-6 so early. Not ideal. Alright, that's expected, for sure. I think we go here. A little buy sell. Penguin? Honestly, dude, sure. Penguin me. I think Rhino up front all day. Peacock, probably unnecessary, but we'll keep him around until we get another level two here, I would say. Um, okay. So, I think the Stingray has got to go. The reason I say that is because Giraffes. the Baboon next turn is going to be splitting between the Rhino and the Stingray, and we cannot afford for that. Gotta get everything on this homie. Beautiful. Okay, what have you got for us here? Um, these are all kind of garbage. <laughs> no hate, but like, you know. Okay. Grab you, grab you. Oh. I don't think I've ever seen the goat before. You know what? Let's throw a goat in here. <laughs> See how it goes. See how it goats. Oh, we've got cats in here too. Oh, baby. Alright, penguin obviously has gotta go. Giraffe obviously has gotta go. Okay. I'd love to go Stingray. See what, let's do this. Give you a little lovin'. And then I'm gonna buy sell the Stingray. Huge. Okay, if they have a skunk, we're gonna be in trouble. That's just the nature of it. Um, if they don't have a skunk, we're also going to be in trouble. So, <laughs> that tells you a little something about our team. And I'm now realizing there was no need to sell the Stingray, because we had all these monkeys anyways. But, such is life, I suppose. Honestly, dude, let's go Leopard. This is a Leopard kind of angle. I'll stand by that. We got these guys. I mean... Poodle would be pretty good. So with two dragons, that might be the pivot we need. Okay. <laughs> We're alive. <laughs> Just barely. Okay. Good hits. Honestly, Baboon's gotta go. Hate to do it to ya, but... That's just how it'd be. Um, that's huge. Let's grab a poodle, I think. I think that makes a lot of sense here. Holy moly, what happened? It doesn't make any sense. <laughs> I drastically misrepresented our team in my head. Um, poodle needs to go now. <laughs> Let's give Dragon a level. Sauropod is pretty good. Um, we're going the Dragons though. I think Mantis Shrimp as a nice little interim unit would be solid. All right, let's, let's see how this goes. Maybe Rhino can come back in the front. I think that's pretty good. Big, big snipes, I love it. Thank you. Oh dude, we're back in it. 
<laughs> this team isn't garbage after all. Um, you can go. Obviously, you gotta buy a cell zebra. Obviously, you gotta buy a cell the octopus. And then we can go back to our dragon. Okay. Ooh, what's more important here? I'm gonna say probably the rhino. But we definitely are gonna freeze you guys. I think the monkey... Someone's gotta go. I don't know who's going yet. Could have frozen that other homie, but I don't think it's necessary. Oh, it's definitely not because <laughs> there's no next round. <laughs> okay, so we're still gathering our wits, you know. We're, we're getting a feel for the weekly. There's a, definitely a lot of scaling options. I think it's gonna be a lot of fun. I'm excited for all of the the health options, all of the buy sell. We'll see. I mean, this is just great. Grab a couple ants, and you're you're off to the races. I mean, we're not we're not gonna be boring, right? We could be some some glistering doggies at my Instagram recommended feed. It's just straight little dogs everywhere. Let's see. Okay. Ah, dude, come on. <laughs> I just want them to know what I'm trying to do. I don't want to have to do it right, you know? Like, what, what the heck is that all about? We definitely could have won that one. It's all right. We got our health back. Not a worry. Uh, let's get a level two. Semi-free. Better fish, sure. Not feeling the ant, I'll be honest with you. I, I'll go in a possum though. I think there's something there. Something worth investigating. Big hedgehog value. Nice, okay. We're on the table. Go here. Do we get rabbit or hatching chick? Um, let's see. Maybe we get rid of the opossum since he's bad. <laughs> no hate. Uh, maybe a little hate. Double bat. That sounds great. Um, do we get rid of... Who do we get rid of here? We get rid of hedgehog. Run a little something like this. Hold on to the rabbit for a second. This is where I have a problem. I don't know who is my target unit to buff. I don't really have one. Uh, that was a bad, bad mathing out for us. Okay, merge you. Grab the rabbit. We're just gonna get a big bat, I think. We could go peacock. Maybe peacock would be smarter. <laughs> Alright, we'll do it, we'll do it. We'll be smart about it. I think this is a natural buy-sell angle. Okay. Yikes, okay. That can't be good. Actually, it's great. <laughs> Shows you how much I know. Um, let's... This is a tricky situation. Hell yeah. Let's, let's grab here. Okay. Okay. I think we could do... Lettuce, maybe? No. That's troll. Grab you. Yeah, okay. This makes way more sense. Grab a garlic for the road. Okay. Not bad at all. 
Okay, what have we got? Let's get this, homie. I mean, that's just good, right? I think we can buy sell the zebra. Probably slightly better to get it all on a single, or all on two units, I should say. We'll go garlic. We'll grab skunk here in a second. That's huge. Double bat. Thank you. He's got the skunk tech on lock right now. Got a breakout art skunk tech. Monkey's definitely the play. I mean, honestly, I don't know if bat is necessary. It could be good. I mean, there's melons. There's a lot that it would override. Maybe giraffe can go. Only giving 2-2 two, two anyways, right? Let's just roll a little, see what we can find. We're getting a lot of bats, that's for sure. The prevalence of the skunks has not gone unnoticed. <laughs> Alright, let's throw you guys on here, give you a little buffing. That's not interesting to me. Alright, we finally didn't get skunked for once. That's nice. It really is a skunk weekly. Just like every time there's a skunk out here. Not the preferred targets there, but so be it. You dirty rhino tiger player. <laughs> They're all the same. <laughs> okay. We gotta have a slot. An open rotating slot. I think monkey can go. Is this our end game team? Is this, is this what we're doing? I think it's gotta be. We have these utility scaling guys. We just gotta... I don't know if we can afford to pivot to a leopard here. We kind of want all of them. <laughs> That's great. I don't think another rabbit's the play. All right. The skunk can only do so much for you. Level me. We could tiger and do tiger bat combo. Maybe that's not necessary though. Or maybe it is. <laughs> I don't know. What do I know? Let's just roll a little bit. See what we can find. Um, I don't think pear is worth it. Looking like it's tempting. Throw him in there. Maybe the rabbit needs to go. Maybe we've, we've ex exhausted the usefulness here. Huge bat, thank you. That could have ended very poorly. That's how you keep him around. Okay. Well, now suddenly these aren't quite as good, these food builds. Um, and we can buy sell a little bit here. Give you a melon, probably. That would make some amount of sense. Maybe we'll just crawl over the finish line with this build. <laughs> Is there ever a chance that'll happen? It's possible. We're getting there. We have a, literally have a level one peacock. <laughs> what is going on here? Okay. I think we go stinky sock here. And then, honestly, dude, I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> 
I'm sure that's like painfully obvious to everybody here right now, but I am at a loss. I mean, maybe the cat can do something for us? Maybe? I guess we'll find out. A 1-1 one, one cat <laughs> holding down the fort. Oh man, okay. Can we get another cat, perhaps? No? Okay. That's fine. I didn't want one anyways, you know. I was just asking for fun. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. <laughs> uh, I think the tiger needs to go behind the bat now. I think that's very important. Let's go, let's, let's roll a second. I think we gotta spread the love a bit. I, I don't even know who to give the chocolate to. <laughs> you know, like, what, what's the objective here? Couldn't tell you. I am floundering in the water right now. I'm not sure what to do. Of course, the one guy that doesn't get the weakness is the octopus. <laughs> All right, we gotta we gotta take a break. We gotta chill, figure out what we're doing with this weekly. We'll come back with one more game and see if we can pull our act together here. All right, I have decided something. I think the best way to do this be some some bumbling jokers at the Dark Knight. Um, so the best way to handle this weekly, in my limited experience, is focus on which which tiers that you're really targeting, right? So in this case, I would argue that tier 4 is horrible. I think there's not a whole lot going on for it, and we need to posture to ensure that we can get through tier 4 without having too many issues. So that may mean going through and trying to get very strong early, get scalers that can carry us through tier four, um, which I think giraffe will do just fine for that. Huge level up here. Um, that could also mean just trying to set up level ups for when we get to tier 4 so we get the tier 5 pets without having to really worry about tier 4. There's a few different ways I think that we can do it, but I think for now that will be our focus. If we can set up a level up, that would be huge. I do think there's a lot of, a lot of value in tier 5 that we would otherwise be missing out on. I think we can sell you not to buy the ant necessarily. We could get a hoopo though. Let's see what this gives us. It'll sell. <laughs> Spider. Okay. Honestly, I think baboon's just nice because we'll get an extra one two on the peacock. I think I like hoopo here because we want to keep giraffe around, and it's gonna screw up the baboon being on tier three. I think we'll just we'll, we'll let it slide. We'll see how this goes. Um, let's just sleep you. Dodo. Probably not the play. Get a little African penguin. We'll swap him out with a bat here in a bit. Okay. That'll get us there. Huge. <laughs> Absolutely huge. Okay, get rid of you. And I think we also, another thing I want to focus on here, keep spots open for scaling units, right? Like, there's so many good buy-sell pets here. It would be a shame to just miss out on them for nothing, you know? Let's roll. Could go baboon here. I think we should. 
Hopefully it goes on Hoopo. Maybe it will, maybe it won't. And... Okay. We got some options here. I guess Peacock should be in the front, shouldn't it? That's my bad. Oh yeah. <laughs> he had his Peacock in the right spot. <laughs> Yeah, so this guy should be here. Honestly, let's just throw these guys in. Get a whole bunch. See see what I mean? We're, we're setting up these level ups here. And then we'll freeze garlic for when the toy breaks next turn. But I think this is good. That's big. So hopefully we can get some level ups now that we're on tier 4. Okay. Maybe get rid of Baboon here. Wait a second, see what we can find. I think Stingray is great. Probably not worth buying right now. But I think next turn we can definitely grab him. Glad we dodged the, the weakness there. That would have been unfortunate. Still unfortunately down by one again. Let's go get rid of Hoopo. Throw in a Stingray here. Let's see if we can get a couple of these level ups going. Hmm, I don't really want to do the buy, sell, and the crow here. We don't have any tier fours. Tell you what, let's do this. Lobster. Freeze you. I don't think dragonfly is a whole lot better. <laughs> Neither is caterpillar. I'll uh, tell you what, let's do... Do this. We'll at least get some scaling here, right? Baboon's probably not long for this world. We're not gonna press that too hard. Big. Huge value. <laughs> we still draw. How unfortunate. I think we need to move you in the back. That's what I'm learning here. Okay, so... And get rid of the lobster. Do a little buy sell here. And I'll buy sell you a little. That's very good. Thank you. And I think let's freeze you for a second. Oh dude, we got double chocolate. Okay, hey, let's go here. Freeze you. I think in Sauropod here. I'm not really sure what we're doing, but I'm hoping something comes to me here. Okay, we gotta level up. We're getting some stats. So far, so good. We're on tier five, the baboon can go. Do a little buy sell of you, Rhino. Tempting, for sure. I don't think it's the play. I think we go here. Freeze the mantis shrimp for a second. think this makes sense. <laughs> Honestly, not entirely sure, but hopefully. Okay, let's try to get a sauropod going. We're doing a good job focusing here. Fortunately, that peacock is going to get the better of us. Level me. Um, let's go... Go here. I think a tiger could be solid. 
Gotta run an avocado. Okay. Freeze the sushi, just because it's good. And we get there. Our butterfly seals the deal. Love to see that. Okay. Go here and here. Ooh, who do we want to give this to? Maybe the sauropod. Do a little something like that. And now we can roll for some some levels. Okay, I like this so far. Yeah, these guys are not extremely strong. <laughs> but we're doing okay. We're getting there. Go here, here. Give you a little melon action. Okay. It's hoping for a few more more doubles than than we found there. Yo! This guy's got a humongous sloth. I'm sorry to to do that to you, but we drew. It's okay. We're not <laughs> we're not taking out the sloth. We're letting him live. We're just also not forfeiting either. Okay, what have we got here? Not a whole lot, to be honest. Oh, you give two, two, the two of them. I like that a lot better, actually. I don't think we'll get it right now. Yeah, we're not going to get it yet. Let's go here. And then just, just stat you up a little bit. Big double level up for next turn. Love to see that. Oh, dude, this melon's doing wonders for us right here. And now I get a power spike too. Oh, hell yeah. I, I goofed that. I should have gotten the avocado. I didn't use the sauropod to its fullest. I got too excited. I'm sorry. Oh, close, close. Okay, we're gonna go here. Oh, this is huge. So much value. I love it. Yeah, man, Sauropod out here doing work. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> We're getting so much value. Let's get some pizza. Dude, there's so many good foods here. Um, Not interested, I don't think. I don't think we go avocado. We got to look for another mantis shrimp, I think. Nothing yet. That counts. That's a mantis shrimp. It may look like chocolate, but it's a mantis shrimp. Huge. Oh, dude. <laughs> we dodged the bat weakness. Love to see it. And yeah, I think now we're just we're throwing as many good foods as we can out in here. Okay, we can throw on some melons next turn. Oh no, <laughs> oh no. Oh, that hurts. Oh, the scaling was too strong. 
I think we're on to something though. I think the takeaway here is pay attention to your scaling timers and your your power timers, I guess, if that makes sense. You know, we're, we, we don't like tier th four, but if we set it up so that we can skip over tier four, it tends to work out all right. It kind of depends. I don't think this this guy did a whole lot, but it was a nice little interim unit. Anyway, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I certainly did. But I will see you all on the next episode. Have a good one.